Hey guys! So today I am coming with you for a awesome collab that I am doing with Swans here on YouTube. Um, we talked about doing a collaboration together and we decided on doing Monster Girls. So basically I've been obsessed with Monster Girls for a while now and um, I really wanted to create something really fun, really intricate for you guys. And I finally found someone to do a collab with for the Monster Girls. She's amazing. Go check out her channel. Um, and if you are coming from her channel, welcome. Um, please hit subscribe. And I really hope you guys like the look. Um, I was inspired by octopuses and tentacles. And yeah. So let's get what I got going on here. I just got a tentacle on my face, just chilling, you know, because, you know, thug life. Um, <laughs> but I really hope you guys enjoy the tutorial. Definitely check out Swan's video for her look. Um, thank you guys so much, and I'm with the tutorial. Woo! <laughs> Alright, so I am starting off with my face done. Um, I just did my foundation and powder and a little bit of concealer under my eyes. Um, you don't have to start. You're going to start with a clean face if that's what works best for you. Um, whatever, like I said, whatever works best for you, you can do. You can do the um, face and powder at the end. Um, I'm just doing it beforehand because it's going to cover up most of my face. So I still want to have some sort of a base for everything to kind of adhere to. So I'm going to start on the normal side, I guess you could call it. And um, the colors I'm using today are from ColourPop. And I'm using the Super Shock Pigment in Fizz and Ibiza. And I am creating kind of like a halo um, inspired eye. So, let's get started. With these, I don't apply a primer. Um, I never have. Uh, they just work really well by themselves. So, I don't feel like they need a primer. So, I'm going to use the Milani Eyeshadow and Bella Chiffon a really pretty creamy vanilla color and just blend okay and I'm going to quickly add some black liquid liner so I added some liquid liner and some liner on my waterline and now I'm going to do a thin blue eyebrow I'm going to use a dark blue and I'm going to be using this LA colors graphics eyeliner and this is in navy. I've never used this before, but here's for trying new things. <laughs> and it came out pretty cool. Um, I'm going to darken it a little bit with my RT face color. Um, and this is in... I don't know, this is the dark navy blue color. I'm just going to kind of go over it to deepen it and add a little bit more color. Use the graphics liner and draw out the shape that I want. After that, I'm going to go back in with that dark blue eyeshadow and just kind of go over it and also blend it inward. And the first color on the tentacle is going to be, of course, from ColourPop and I'm using the color Fantasy. And I'm going to put that on the top half. I guess it would be the top half of my tentacle. Sounds weird, doesn't it? 
and just gonna start applying. The next color I'm going to use is also, again, ColourPop. It is Slave to Pink. It's one of my all-time favorite eyeshadows ever. It's gorgeous hot pink, and it has like a purpley shimmer to it, so that's amazing. I deepen up the purple a little bit because it kind of I don't know it just kind of looks like all one color to me I don't really know how it looks on camera but I'm going to take some of that um, Ibiza and I'm just going to add it to the top part of the purple I'm going to go ahead and draw the other eyebrow on. Alright, so I have it blended, and I'm going to go ahead and add some liner as well. Okay, and I'm going to go ahead and just double up on mascara because I cannot, for the life of me, find my eyelash glue. But I was going to use the um, Ardell Demi Wispies with the Plum Accent, the Mega Flamed Curl Mascara. Oh. My Manga Voluminous um, Mascara. And now I'm going to add the little suction cups only on one side of the tentacle. Um, just so it kind of looks like it's like on the side. Mika K Shimmer Eyeliner, and this is a silver color. You can really use any color you have. White would look good, silver, like bright the blues and the pinks and stuff would look good. So I'm just going to draw little circles to represent suction cups in all different sizes. Alright, and now that the suction cups are finished, I'm going to line my lips and fill them in with my um, The Balm Mr. Right Now Liner in Rouge. It's a really nice dark blue. Um, and then I'm going to go over it with a kind of a sheer black lipstick. This is the Moody Black Lipstick from Nika K. lips are done and I'm going to quickly kind of highlight this side of my face and give it some sort of dimension you know something so I'm going to use my Mary Luminizer um, powder and I'm just going to apply that on the very very tops of my cheeks really concentrating to contour with a darker, um, kind of a pinky purple brownish blush. I'm going to contour really, really well. Okay, and I added this really fun green wig. Um, you can add really any color, but I just, I love this wig so much, and I thought it would be perfect for my little monster girl. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you have not. Um, definitely check out Sarah's look. I'm very, very excited to see hers. And 
I really hope you guys enjoyed. I know it was a long one, but I really wanted to create something really, really, really fun for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will talk to you later. Bye!